Hey. I said, turn that thing down and out of hell with school. <laughs> what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? It's Tuesday. We're playing hooky. We got the Empress DeVoe into his house, ladies and gentlemen. I know y'all been looking at her. We got all the mail. Oh, there she go again. There she go again. There she go again. Here's time for morning coffee. The show that comes to you live and unscripted. Direct to you from Los Angeles, California, Lamert Park. Hey, we are the Righteous Brothers of Lamert Park. Coming to you live and unscripted, like I said. And today is no different than other days, except we have the grand energy of the Empress, the gifted one, the Empress DeVoe, ladies and gentlemen. Oh boy, oh boy, my name is Mario Hemsley. I'm here with my partner in crime, Victor Allen. Hey. We're waking up. We have our fruit cup, our coffee, Vic. Yes. What kind of day you think it's going to be today? You know, it's a day where you sit back and appreciate those. You know, I don't know if you can hear me, but feel me that Serena Williams has come back all the way with tears. That's the hot story. Got to give love to the women in tennis. Hot pits. All I can say is Long Beach, Florida. Florida is ruling on our hot pit week. Dude, I don't know what's up. You got to tell me something good or bad. It's going to be good. It's going to be good, you guys. We got some crazy videos today, though. You know, so I don't know. Y'all going to be outraged, but I tell you what, you're going to be entertained. Hey, this is the show that comes to you live. I told you, go and get your morning, whatever you're having. That's right. Get your fresh fruit. Get your brand muffins. Get that scrambled eggs. Hey, whatever you're sipping on, whatever you're smoking on. Those illegal Cubans. Those unfiltered camels. That badass Cali, whatever you're having this morning, baby, come on and do it with us. Oh, you want a back shot? Look at that. Oh, man, talking about locks in your future. <laughs> hey, Nicole, can you tell me something good? Anything, any news. You know what? I'm hearing this morning. That's what's good, because I just think I was going to make it. I'm very tired of it. I was late last night. <laughs> In the streets once again. Come on, do it. Hey, you guys, you know, sports is always in the news. But, you know, at the same time, we always have to understand that sports that's not from the United States has to be respected. I'm into part cheesy. What else? Uh, checkers? Hey. <laughs> Hey, it's going to be one of those days. I tell you, strap yourself in the seats. Come on. Get your stretch on. Get your move on. Loosen up those old muscles. Come on. I, I think the boat should show the move. The club move. The vibes with me. Right? Oh, my gosh. She's getting low. She's getting low. I'm, oh. I'm getting the cramp. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, give it to him, man. Hey, woo. let's just do what we came to do. Just be, be. Come on, everybody, let's do it. Be cool. All right. <laughs> All right. You know what? Um, well, that's my aerobics I don't know. for the morning. I don't know. You know, um, you've changed the environment around here. Hey, you guys, welcome to Morning Coffee. You know, I have to sit back and see if you can bring over some fellow sisters. I Someone to join me on this side so I can get my rhythm off. Oh, that's true. Yeah. True. Yeah. You know, I need my rhythm. Well, I'm going to see if I can get my friend Ann to come out. Hmm. Oh, out of the closet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going to be hot. <laughs> what kind of a show? What kind of a show? <laughs> Ladies oh, and gentlemen, yeah. what a day. Like DeVoe said, we too have to ease ourselves into the broadcast mm -hmm. energy, right? I mean, you are some harder some days than others, right? That's right. See, and, and we all have our, our routines that we have in the morning. You know, when Mac McAllister, our GNM bureau chief, does his show, he has the Francis Ford Coppola. He has a glass of that uh, director's cut. But he doesn't <laughs> do that in the morning, right? His show's in the evening. What time? What does it make? He's retired. <laughs> morning, evening. A glass of wine in the morning. Mac, do you believe With that? breakfast. That's the way the French do it. <laughs> A little bit of orange juice, a mimosa, <laughs> champagne and orange juice is a way to start the day. So <laughs> wait we, a minute, wait a minute. He said he had a dashiki exactly like the, um, I have a dashiki exactly like that in the uh, 60s. Are you kidding? Oh, see what I'm saying? He said, mind your outfit. See how instant he, like this in the 60s? Matt McAllister, old. our GDM bureau chief. Also, he's the, he's our in effect ambassador of the chat room. Mac, I just, I just keep throwing stuff on <laughs> He's got all these things. But everybody, welcome. You know, today is Tuesday. It's, let me get my visual aids. Come on now. Oh, there yes, it is. today is Tuesday. Tuesday, June 21st. Take a look at the picture once again of DeVoe. We have a wonderful picture of her right there. I have to send you a new one. Oh, yes. We need something else. 
The other ones are kind of stuck together. Ew. But, but Ew. My, what? I, I spilled coffee. What are you thinking? <laughs> anyway, okay. every week we have a slogan. And this week the slogan is by none other than Frederick Douglass in honor of Father's Day. And, in, you know, we had a special show yesterday to honor fathers. Well, yeah. That's all the fathers, you know, all the things fathers are going through. Because they've been going through a lot. Yeah. And we wanted to acknowledge that. So we did a special quote. And this one is from Frederick Douglass. And the quote is, if there is no struggle, there is no progress. If there is no struggle, there is no progress. So that's why we progressing. And then once you progress, you need to stop struggling. <laughs> I love that. That's so prophetic. I'm sorry. I, I got to remember that one. <laughs> you know, there was I a sign on one. the yeah. side of this cafe that said, believe in your struggle. Now, I don't really understand that. What I want to believe in is my, my success. And I want to believe that my struggle is not really there. Okay. Mm. Mm. Okay. That's kind of heavy. I got to sip my coffee. <laughs> <laughs> but the journey continues nonetheless, right? Right. And so today we're going to signify that. Um, foo foo. It's giving you an African nickname well, for the know, day. I wore my feathers too, so I'm a little cross between Native American and African today. Well, well that's cool. All right, right, well, that may be pertinent. That may be pertinent for the stories because DeVoe. You know, the stories today are kind of strange. I tried to adjust it a little bit okay. because of you, you know. Okay. And because of that, we have some crazy videos. For one, we have this video about this incident I know you guys heard about on the subway train, about this woman who was talking really loud and using some crude language and ended up getting in some kind of a confrontation with the, uh, with the, uh, the, the train attendant who asked her to cut it out. Uh, so you'll have a video of that. It's going viral on the internet because she says she was too educated <laughs> <laughs> to be kicked off the train. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we also have this other video, Samuel L. Jackson and Werner Herzog. Uh, Vic, I don't know. Can we read? The, uh, <laughs> Wait a minute. No, no, no. Let you go. Let you go with it. Go I'm the fuck to sleep. <laughs> it's a crazy reading. That's the I name. Know. Go the F to sleep. <laughs> no, it's really a piece by Samuel L. Jackson and Werner Herzog, you guys. And I'm telling you, I can't help it if they have these expletives in there. You, you can sorry. close. It. That's all right. You can close. It. I'm sorry. It's porn. But, uh, but you, so it's kind of crazy. So we got that, you guys. Okay. Also, I got some other crazy videos for you because I felt like you needed attention. We got the fried Kool Aid video. Mm. We got a new music piece by Radiohead from oh. their upcoming CD release. Got it. And we got another funny Harry Potter spoof. You know, all week long it's Harry Potter stuff because Harry Potter's just you know, yeah. sending us tons of Harry Potter stuff. This one is a Harry Potter spoof called Harry Potter with ADHD. Oh. <laughs> now, the stories we got today, we've got a story about the Indian maids at risk of sexual abuse. As you heard recently, the IMF, former IMF chief who assaulted a, a maid at the hotel in New York, well, as it caused people to go do some looking, and as it turns out, Indian maids are at a higher risk of sexual abuse. So we're going to talk a little bit about that. Wow. Also, America's forgotten homeless students. Homeless students. Yeah, but they're, they're actually forgotten. Uh, we're going to talk about this deadly E. coli that's been going around. They had some all over Europe and some here in the U.S. Well, some people are saying it was actually engineered. Really? I believe that. Wow. And actually an engineered strain. Keith Oberman is predicting a Republican sex scandal. Is that hard? He says it's already rumors and talk going out, but people are not saying much yet because everybody's trying to get proof. But people say there is a Republican sex scandal coming. Okay. Okay, and Bill Gates donates $1 billion to vaccine programs in Africa. Wow. That's so once hot. again, he's continuing. They're trying to wipe out tuberculosis Very good. in Africa. You know, they did this. They got together these groups, and they actually – put a cost on wiping out certain diseases globally. Well, good really? for them. So they really want to do something with their it, with their money. Good. Yes, yes. There's some good good folks in the world. Just don't make it bad news today, man. Whatever yeah, well, there's about five bad news topic and one good news topic. What's <laughs> up with that, Mario? Oh, you counting, right? Of course. Oh, get, you know, DeVoe, right now. I'm trying to make it up with the funny-ass videos. <laughs> That's, that's, a, that's the hell. best. That's what the, the hell do you want? The, the news sucks, okay? <laughs> I t news sucks. I'm fixing up with some videos. These are what we call uh, media band-aids. 
Say How's hi, that? Devo, say, hi, say hi to Danny. Wake up, everybody. Hi, Danny. There you go. Danny's out there. Does she, are you oh, having? I hope was, she's having her for here. Actually, that was Have me. some of my fruit cup. <laughs> you talking about here on the screen? That's me. Oh, so you logged in as Danny. So you are a false yeah. prophet. You need to log in right there. I can't believe you. You said that. Log in as you. That is terrible. That is that log in as you, sweetie. Oh my god. You know what? You, now I got to do the work. Oh my god. I you know log in is not considered work. <laughs> Lord. Lord, I know. I, I love black people. <laughs> anyway, you guys, I want you. I, I'm having fruit cup. You know, we're doing this. Why are we showing you this? Because we're trying to get you all. We're worried about your colon. <laughs> we're worried about your colon. <laughs> I am. I'm worried about it. it keeps me up. <laughs> yeah, I am trying to get some sleep, and here's your colon on my mind. <laughs> Woo, I could imagine you. your nightmares. Yeah, tell you some <laughs> sticky. So I want you to eat some. We're trying to endorse the fruit cup and the the whole grain cereals, like That's oatmeal. Good. Do you have you had oatmeal lately? No, I don't like oatmeal. Oh, okay. I'm really the fruit girl. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm, well, I'll let, let that go. I let that go. Right. <laughs> well, there's a lot of stuff today, and and plus, you guys, the eagle cams, the the eaglets are flying. Just they 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 grabbing stuff and all. Really? So we gotta visit the eaglet camp. Have you gave them names yet? It's, have I? Yeah. Have I? Moi? No. No, no but I, we've been watching. You know, I know you've been live, watching. This, this is the live time. eagle camps. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. All right. So I'm trying to see uh, what else we got. So that's all we're gonna have today. Is everybody cool with that? Yeah. No. And of course we'll have some happy time. Uh, no. <laughs> Wait a minute, Devo. You're you're saying you don't want happy time. No happy time. Well, so oh, so you don't want. Why wow, you dressed news. appropriately? <laughs> well, you got a little. Look at this. You got a little. To make it, we see she's got holes in her jeans. Well, that's how they used that to That have wear a it. design. Can you get your leg up here? In my face? Oh, there, it's there. <laughs> you didn't chase the cat Look away. Look at this, you guys. She got holes in her jeans with mesh and little designs and artwork. Devo. She got a little artwork in her jeans. He's trying to touch your leg. I'm just saying, this is you don't get this every. This is eclectic. It's eclectic. I'm telling you, that's why. Well, all right. Well, now that we got you, showed you Devo's leg. Okay. It's time, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for foreplay. That's right. Just a very few moments to seduce your mind. The who, what, where, when, and why of Paxdale TV, because we want you to know what's happening. Hey, it all started like this. A small black seed was dropped into some water. And with the proper nurturing and growth, one day Mario Hemsley became an adult. Somewhere in that process, he had the idea to bring to you something new and different. Initially, initially involved radio, but then the internet came along. And soon we grew and the little black seed that had grown into a man decided it was time now to do internet television. So he took to his studio where he works late into the night, late, 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 often with his robe open when his parents weren't home, just to bring you internet television. That's right. And when he invented it, and he had it working, he had converted the radio station software to now play video, he went looking far and low, high and wide, but ladies and gentlemen, there was no help to be found until he came upon the gifted one, the man who had always been there, the partner in crime, Victor Allen, who too decided he would take on this wonderful journey of internet television. And so, ladies and gentlemen, Neil Urban Internet Television was born, and it came to you live and unscripted from the internet, and you said, what? What? What is this? What could it be? Ooh, but I like it. I must have more. I know, and like the proverbial first taste of that chocolate ice cream sundae, you knew that you had stumbled upon something new and different. Like the first time you ever touched yourself in those private parts, you knew something had happened. Forever your life had changed, that is internet television, and ladies and gentlemen, welcome. All right. I'm telling you, because we built this ship, and I know it like the back of my hand. There are no cameramen. There are no audio or sound technicians. We come to you live, and we bring to you the likes of personalities such as the Empress DeVoe. There you go. You can't find this, ladies and gentlemen. 
And also, we go far and wide. I'm telling you, up in Washington, in Port Townsend, the GNM Bureau Chief sits in command up there. That's right. Doing his own thing. Coming to you live. Mac McAllister, the Retro Jazz and Blues Show that you can get online with Mac.ning.com. As you can see, we are spreading like herpes. Oh. No. oh. Okay, we're spreading like divorce. <laughs> all the bad shit is spreading. No, we're, all right. We're spreading, we spreading like wild we're spreading flowers. Like, we're spreading like natural Art. lubricants. We are spreading, ladies and gentlemen. So remember, tune in. And then remember, too, if you want your own internet television, you can do it. Just contact Victor Allen, and he'll tell you how, why. You can go live with Neil Urban Internet Television. And all you artists out there, send us something. Make some videos. Baby, we like doing this. We love living the dream and doing the impossible. Right. And always remember, this world needs an enemy. This world! This world needs an enema! Okay, wow. Wow, that was new, Victor. Yes. He has a new little spiel now. Just every every week is new, baby. Every every week. You gotta be, you gotta open I'm up your ears. Trying to change up now. I'm about to turn 55. <laughs> and I can see the lights going out. If <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't for Mac, keep me going. It inspired me. Encouraging I'm you. I'm telling you. Mm. Oh, you look got, at the Native American Indian. That's Mac. <laughs> that's not a Native American. See, this is what happens. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here's the retro jazz and blues. <laughs> Mac McAllister, GNN, Chief, the creator, director, producer of Retro Jazz and Blues. It's the weekly radio show. That's I mean, right. he drops it on us every week. That's right. You got to go check it out. Why are you laughing? Online with Mac. I just dressed appropriate today, I guess. I'm going to be switching his too. picture up, too, <laughs> as everybody can see. But he has the good music for all, everybody who likes that retro jazz and blues. All right, you guys. But, hey, so we got some stuff. Okay, I didn't, did I tell the announcements, too, Vic? You did some. You did. That, the, uh, you that we got did. this website redesigned. Oh, no, I didn't no, tell you that. Sorry. No, you didn't. We are doing a redesign. Vic has it. We're, well, we've been getting a lot of mail about the w website. Mm -hmm. And um, that was some really terrible things to say to us. <laughs> I want you to know some of that mail. <laughs> constructive and, criticism. And some of those, that mail, that is a really, really vulgar thing to do with a tiny woodland creature. And we would never do that. What okay. did they say? I won't go into it. It sounded very <laughs> you painful. Have to go into it? But uh, I wanted to, everybody to know the website redesign is underway. We're going to have this new look coming soon. Victor and I are working on it. We're doing some widget designing. Yes. Uh, the 24 hour broadcast is going well. We are asking artists, we're seeking artists. I'm actually behind on it because we're doing all this other stuff. But we're going to be reaching out, for example, to the Billboard Top 100 Unsigned Bands. Sir. They're all on MySpace. That would you, be us. The man with no name. Then you should get a letter, an email, asking for content. Because we're going to start showcasing you guys more and more right. of the top indie music out there. Okay. Including DeVos. Yeah. Band with no name. Yeah. That's right. But we're okay. performing every Saturday They have night. music. So there you go. <laughs> all right. Well, get them, get them to send us videos to broadcast and showcase. And go to our, and by the way, if you go to the main, main the main page, we have the new indie section, right? The indie artist promos. Yeah. So you can go there and find out all about the promotions for indie artists. Okay. Okay. All right. And be okay. And one last thing, the CD DV store has been upgraded. By the way, as you move through the website, you'll notice many more virtual characters. We are creating more and more virtual characters. This is what you do when you have more time on your hands late at night. <laughs> And these characters tell us what to do. Is that what you would like? <laughs> no, I just what, noticed that like your virtual that? Uh, characters they can, are telling us what to do. They can tell you what to do. <laughs> okay. But you know. All right, all right. All right, so that's what's going on. So now, DeVoe, are you ready? Your chair is squeaking up a storm. It's like the bed. Why don't you put some WD-40 on that? <laughs> I'm just saying. I'll, if I hand you the WD-40, will you get down there? <laughs> I mean, we can hand it to you. You know how they... The white women will no. be here on Monday, everybody. <laughs> they won't do it either, trust me. <laughs> They've been watching us too long. <laughs> All right, you guys, but I, I'm trying to think. Well, let's do this first. Let's do this first, you guys, before we even go, because I don't think this can be part of the show. 
Let's go to the, the bald eagle, the live bald eagle nest cam, because you got to have it. See? See, now they've changed the angle of the camera. I don't know. Well, the nest, well, they got the eagles all the time. Well, oh, here gotta, we go. Well, um, they got to move around. And that's see how they do you, where the minute they show you like about five seconds of eagles. Right. Then they show you a commercial. Well, yeah, they want to trick you into it. Then they'll bring you the eagles back. Oh. So I have to so I have to talk. You have to talk and say a little then, something. Okay, here we go. Now you can see the little eagles. There's the eagles in the trees. This is the live eagle cam. Mm. Yeah, I think that's cool. Quite interesting. Look at them. How precious. Yeah, you don't know move. your password? Oh. <laughs> I thought it was one I thought it was one name. That's you you sign it in. Is that your name? What's yes. your what's your I don't think that's your well, news. Do you name. have to say it out loud? Everybody <laughs> has to hear what we're supposed doing to know your here. username on you can't up. log into Twitter. Oh my god. She can't log into Twitter. I I'm just shut up. Now while while they Talk about login. So you have to spell it exactly I'll right. I'll explain what we're looking at. We're the looking at trying two to log in. Windy birds. Thank you. They're, Those are the live. <laughs> that's the bald eagle cam. That used to be the little eaglets, the ones that the little mama that had the mother eagle. Mm -hmm. She was carrying, you know, woodland creatures up into the nest and hacking them into little bits. Yo. Yep. And regurgitating into the mouths of the eagles so they could grow strong like this. And if you're missing small children in the area. It's been suspect. <laughs> no, what's really going All on? All right. But I want y'all to see because it's still there mm -hmm. and it's becoming more popular, you guys. It's 24 hours a day because the eagles are now flying around. So I guess they have the cam where they can move the cam by remote control. So they follow the eagles around. Yep. It looks good. That's well, not your username. It's not? How do you know what my username is? Because I send you oh, tweets. Oh, so the bald eagles are on Neighborhood Watch. I got you. I got you. All right. The vote will know her username on Twitter. No, I, I just don't <laughs> use Twitter, okay? I'm Facebook. Okay. I got four Facebooks. I have no You signed it with Facebook? 